Hello, my little wonders. Welcome to Rakyun. Or Rakyun? I'm not completely sure how the title is pronounced, but I would say Rakyun because it sounds better. So why not? <laughs> it's an RPG maker game and it looked very cute and very sweet. And it's an English game, so I can practice my English a little bit with you. So why not? <laughs> <laughs> All right, like you can see, I don't know anything about the game. I didn't play it or anything like that. It will be completely blind, and I hear that there are a lot of puzzles and it's a very cute story. So let's see what we can find in the world of Requiem. <laughs> All right, let's start. Okay, cool. <laughs> um. It's a long time ago that I played a game with mouse and keyboard, but I will try my hardest. Do I need my mouse? I'm not sure. Who's there? Hi. <laughs> you're a little bit creepy looking. And the way you appeared. It's weird. It's weird. I don't want to judge you, but it's weird. Hey. How did you get in here? Your door's unlocked, man. Oh. Who are you? I'm Yami. I live across the hall. Did you just move in or something? No, I think I got here around the same time as you. But they never let me out of my room. Oh, I'm sorry. Eh, it's okay. I sneak out at night, when the nurses aren't watching. <laughs> promise you won't tell anyone I'm here, okay? I promise. Okay, he's cute. I'm sorry that I judged you. I misjudged you. I'm sorry. So, how long are you in here for? I don't know. Mom says it could be a while. Same here. It gets really boring sometimes. I know what you mean. Someone's coming. Sorry, man. I gotta go. Hey, wait. Yeah. Maybe I could visit you sometime. It's not as boring when there's two. You won't be able to get into my room. What? Why? <laughs> Do you have a disease or something? I think I'm in a hospital. Do you have a disease? Was it dangerous that you were near me? <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm not even supposed to leave, remember? Oh, yeah. But don't worry, I come visit you again. I promise. Maybe I don't want that. Maybe I don't want that, Yami. Maybe I don't want that. I'm not sure about you. <laughs> okay, bye. Yami? Let's you go. Oh my fucking god, he's a ghost. He's a ghost. That's why I cannot come to his room. He's a ghost. Oh, okay, cool. Okay, cool. Let's put my mouse away. How did I interact with anything? I can't remember. Okay, spacebar. Gotcha. Whoa. A houseplant that looks like it could use some water. Can I water it? 
What's that? My toilet. Nice. Is it a sink with water? Yes. The sink is filled with water. Awesome. Do you need to pee? Okay, sorry. Okay, what do we have here? Patient 237. You can so forget that I can read that. <laughs> Medical stuff. Cool, cool. Oh, coming. Hello? Hello, dear. It's mom. Mom! Just wanted to let you know that my train was delayed, so I'm going to be a little bit late. Aww. Okay. I'm so sorry, dear. I'm going as fast as I can. That's okay, Mom. I understand. But I'm off work this week, and I dropped off your little brother at Grandma's. So, we will be able to spend lots of time together. We can play games. I will read to you. It will be like our own little party. Thanks, Mom. I love you. I love you too. Okay. <laughs> that was bright. <laughs> well, well. I see you're wide awake and walking around. No one told me I couldn't walk around. Ha! <laughs> okay, wise guy. I've got a couple of things to tell you. First of all, some good news. Your tests have come back and it turns out things are looking pretty good. In fact, I think it might be okay for you to walk around the halls a bit today. You mean... I get to leave my room? Indeed. Yes. Not so fast. There is something else I need to talk to you about. This morning, the cafeteria reported that a lot of food and drinks were stolen from the kitchen. Since the wing was all locked up last night, we believe the thief might still be in this building somewhere. So can you take a moment to just check and see if any of your belongings were stolen? Okay. Push the call button? No. I have a second hat. No origami hat. I have a second one. I love it. Treatment guide. Oh no. It's gone! Doctor, they took it. They took Rakian. Rakian. I don't know how to pronounce that, but it's okay, I'm a child. <laughs> what did they take? You, you get another voice every time. I'm so sorry. Rakian. It's my favorite book in the whole world. My mom reads it to me every night. It's very special. Are you completely sure you didn't just misplace it? I'm sure. After mom finished reading, she always, always puts it back in the same place. It's our tradition. Okay, calm down. What did your book look like? Hmm. It has a brown cover. It looks very old. And there's a clasp, made of silver, with a hole for a key. Silver clasps, huh? I guess that explains why they take a children's storybook. Well, I'm very sorry about this. I can only imagine how important it must have been to you. I want you to know that we will be doing all we can to track down the thieves. 
Mom's gonna be so sad. Hmm. You know what? What? Since you're allowed to leave your room today, why don't you go talk to someone of the other folks around the floor? Who knows? Maybe someone will be able to help you get your book back. Take care now. I'll be back to check on you in a bit. Bye. Well done. My Rakion was stolen. The door's locked. There's a sign on top of the door. Read it. Okay. Storage area 5B. Patients not allowed beyond this point. I live in a storage room? Why not? Let's go. Hey, Doctor. Did you find my book? How is the detective work coming along? Find any good leads? Nope. Just started. Wait. Open the locker? Yes. You find a pair of scraps hanging inside. Cool. Open the locker? Yes. The lab coat and a pair of scraps are hanging inside. It looks like there's something beneath the lab coat. Look underneath? Okay. You found 5G. I stole money. Do you want it back? Was this your locker? I'm not sure about anything. <laughs> What's my name? Can I read my name? Oh shit. Boys room. <laughs> okay, cool. <laughs> Hello there. What the heck do you think you're doing in my room, kid? Get out! Figures. When I want visitors, no one shows up. But when I need peace and quiet, every idiot in the world has to come in my room. And where is the nurse with my coffee? Okay, cool. The book about airplanes. Cool. A broken music box. If you touch that music box, I break your hands. Okay. <laughs> There's no point in talking to Tony before he had his coffee. He will just growl at you like a big angry bear. I heard that, you little brat. See what I mean? <laughs> okay, cool. Open the cabinet? Yep. You found 5G. Oh my god, I'm getting rich. The door is locked. Okay, cool. Bye. Do -dup, do -dup, do -dup, do -dup. Oh my god, you look so cool. Wait a second. The door is locked. Look at the sign. Keep out. Only authorized personnel allowed beyond this point. Okay, cool. Open the cabinet. Yep. Folders with med medical forms. It looks like there's something beneath the folders. Look underneath? Yes. I'm getting so rich. Oh shit. It's empty. Okay, cool. You look so cool. Hey there. You look so cool. Look at your pink hair. I love it. <laughs> you might have a girl. Uh, what's up? Hey, I don't know. I don't think we formally met yet. I'm Cora. It's probably pretty easy to remember me because I'm the only girl in my grade with a pink mohawk. Wow, <laughs> cool. And don't worry, my mom knows. <laughs> She's the one who let me do it. Anyways, it was nice meeting you. <laughs> nice meeting you too, Cora. Oh hey, some friends and I are working together to do something special for the people on our floor here in the hospital. Like what? I will have more details later, but if you find anything cool you want to donate, come talk to me. Okay. I know a lot of folks feel powerless when they have to stay here. 
but here's the way I see it. No one knows how much time they have in this world. My time could be up in 80 years. Or 8 minutes. Hmm. Point is, I'm gonna do everything I can to make good use of my time. Time's precious, you know. If I could help just one person here to feel happier, then I'd all be with it. <laughs> hey there. Did you hear about the thief? Dude, yeah. She, Chef Penki came out here earlier and she was not happy. I guess the thief took a lot of food from the cafeteria kitchen. How the heck did they get into the kitchen? You can't even get there from the cafeteria. Believe me, I tried. <laughs> hey there. Tell me about the fox here. Who do you want to know about? Tony. Just between you and me, I think Tony's hiding something. He acts so grumpy all the time, but he's got this pretty little music box in his room that he guards with his life. Why would a grumpy old dude like that have a sweet little music box? Oh, I'm fine. Thanks, bye! Can I play with that? Oh my god! <laughs> I love you! <laughs> you have blue hair, you have a little teddy bear in your head, I love you! <laughs> Hello, small child! What brings you to my blood draw station? Interested in learning about the circulation? There is circularity. <laughs> circulatory system. No. Uh, no. Um. <clears throat> what can I help you with? Uh. Did you hear about the thief? Come here. I let you in on a little secret. Have you noticed anything strange about the hospital? Hmm. Not really. A while back, I started noticing cryptic little messages written all over the place. At last, and last night, I saw someone go into that closet south of Tony's room. But I was told that closet has been locked since before I started working here. I'm pretty sure they were not staff. What did they look like? I only saw them out of the corner of my eye, and for but a second. So, unfortunately, I could not say. What can I help you with? I'm fine. Bye. Hey, plant. Did you call me? Yeah. Apparently, the toilet in Sue's room is broken now. Can you do anything about it? I'm a nurse. I'm not a plumber. I don't even know how to fix the toilet. Well, someone has to do it. You know, we're short-staffed. Fine. I go see if I can dig up some supplies. Bye! Hey, quick bugger me, kid. I've got a lot to do right now. And my stomach is growling. <laughs> what would I give for a peanut choo choo? Peanut choo choo. Give me a second. Can I get you that? It's your snack. Vending machine. <gasps> I can't. Oh my god, girl, it's your lucky day. A pair of scraps hanging inside. Cool. The door is rusted right shut. Okay, cool. Now, where did I put that key? I must have dropped it somewhere. Oh, you're missing a key? Don't worry, I will find it. Go to sleep. No, I don't.
girl, it's your lucky day. Here you go. Wait, you've given this to me? Wow, thank you. <laughs> I haven't eaten anything at all day. I haven't any I haven't eaten anything all day. I guess they won't mind if I go take a short break. Bye girl! See you around. Which do you want to search? Books, padlets, newspaper clipping and sticking out from between the two books. Read it. Okay. 19th March. Already strapped for resources, hospitals are unable to accommodate new patients. <laughs> so, the hospital full of people? Interesting. Several years worth of medical journals. Which do you want to search? Folders filled with medical forms. A laminate card is clipped to the back of the one of the folders. Read the card? Okay. Closet 5C password. Oh, I should write that down, shouldn't I? Give me a second. Okay, cool. Closet. Closet 5C. 1, 7, 2, 1. Gotcha! <clears throat> Patient survey. Okay, anything else here? Okay, bye! Hey, nurse. The toilet in there is broken. Some metal thing is stuck inside. If you have to go, you should probably find a different bathroom. Okay, cool, bye. Hey, lady. <laughs> you don't mind that I opened your drawer thing? You don't mind? Really? Okay, cool, talk to me. How are you doing today? What's up? My wife's been asleep for months now. Oh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm very sorry. Um... <laughs> I'm maybe, maybe six, maybe five, six, seven, <laughs> something like that. Maybe be a little bit more babyish to me. I would support that. But I still talk with her every day, and sometimes I read to her. How are you doing today? <laughs> You're a very nice guy, by the way. Have you noticed? That some of the doctors around here have electronic passcode devices? I've been told that those areas have long been closed off even to the staff. But recently, I noticed that one of the devices has been turned on. How are you doing today? <laughs> good, good talking buddy. See ya. Hey girl. Hello. Hello. <laughs> wow, so many different models. Yeah, I've been collecting for a long time. That's a nice girl. Bye. See you around. Bye bye. Okay, cool. Uh, whoop, whoop. <laughs> The door is locked. What the fuck? The hospital is completely broken down, isn't it? <laughs> it appears that there is a tunnel running through here that has been blocked up. Perhaps you could get through if you had the right tools. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> Hello, darling. I haven't seen you in a long time. It's good to see you walking around again. You need something? What's up? 
It seems these days it's getting harder and harder to find the words. Either that, or people just aren't listening. I think the second one. But you know, if it's my time to leave this world, then I'm ready to go. I just want to make sure I say the things I need to say before it's too late. You need something? You're a very wise man. Did you hear about the thief? I've been telling the nurses for a long time that someone has been sneaking around here after hours. I feared they were stealing food from the cafeteria kitchen. Which means they obviously have some way of getting into parts of the hospital that we patients don't have access to. What were they crawling through the vents? You have to be pretty small to fit through there. But no one around here listens to me anyway. They all seem to think that I lost my mind. You need something? Thanks, buddy. Nice flower. Can I touch it? I can't. Bye! Alright, alright, alright! The door's locked. Cool. Let's go in the cafeteria. Why not? <laughs> what? There was a sign of a cafeteria. Am I, am I stupid? Cafeteria, right? Come on, little boy! <laughs> yes, okay, good. <laughs> Just wanted to make sure. The door is rusted shut. <sighs> Hello. The new patient launch is still being built. Please come back later. Alright, bye. A lot of things are under construction here, aren't there? Magazines, notebooks, and other paper materials can be found here. Cool. This bin is filled with ice cream and other frozen snacks. Various drinks, yogurt, and fruit cups line the shelves. Oh my god, a kitty cat! A pile of freshly made plushie toys. Oh my god. I told you you're not supposed to have cats in the hospital. It's fine. She's a seeing eye cat. My vision is really bad. Get it out of here, Danielle. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Panky is the worst. <laughs> They're cute. Give me a second. I want to talk to him first. Are we in Japan? Hey there, long time no see, buddy. You hungry? You need something? What's up? Did you hear? They finally stuck the vending machine out in the hospital oh, with peanut choo-choos. I know, I bought one of them. The shift leader was in here the other day begging us to do it. Guess it's not just kids, they like them, huh? You need something? Did you hear about the thief? Oh yeah, someone came in here and took a bunch of food and drinks. Ain't no way they got in here through the cafeteria. See that metal door up there? It comes down after hours and no one gets through that. So I bet they somehow got into this backspace. The backspace? Yeah. It's a network of closed off passageway, half built rooms, storage clothes, you know. The aftermath of, well, yeah, it's crazy, but there. Back there, I'm sorry. <laughs> Alright, bye. Plushy lady, hello. Hey, kiddo, you seen something? Uh, you need something? <laughs> What's up? I'm just finishing a, ban a batch of plushies. My goal is to make one for all the patients in the floor. On the floor. 
<laughs> My goal is to make one for all the patients on the floor, even old cranky men like Tony and Panky. Nah, <laughs> oh, you're dead. Good. <laughs> hey, kiddo, you need something? Did you hear about the thief? Don't tell anyone. I told you this, but you know how some of the doors around here have some electronic lockbox things, things on them. I hear that they keep the password somewhere behind the reception desk. That's across from Kisa Budo's room. I think I have that. <laughs> What do you think? It's beyond those doors. You mean you haven't been there? What? No, of course not. I'm just a volunteer. Hey, <laughs> kiddo. You need something? Hi. Hey, little lady. Sorry, hon. But you know you're not supposed to leave this wing. Okay, bye. Can I have the plushie? Where can I have the plushie? I'm a patient here too. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs>